What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Um, this is free general collective reading, so it's very important to only take the messages, messages that resonate, leave the rest. We're at 11,675 subscribers right now, so thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. You guys are just the best. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. From the bottom of my heart chakra, I really, really do. I just want to let everybody know that. Um, thanks so much. Okay, so um, I was meditating this morning. Um, people are still in bed, so um, I was sitting here chilling. And so I got a channel message. I'm going to share it. Hope everybody is doing well. I do, I do, I do. -who. Okay, so the channel message I received was um, someone who stole from and set up a um, whistleblower in the past is about to re reap their karma very soon. Heavy negative karma. Uh, and then I heard, it was about 45 seconds after that, I heard someone's about to become a whistleblower very soon. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Oh my gosh. So a lot of whistleblower energy um, in here. Um, now, I mean, I'm sure you guys probably know what a whistleblower is. It's basically someone that stands up and reports something. Um, I'm going to read the official Google definition for it, but that's basically what it is. Whistleblower, a person who informs a per on a person or organization engaged in an illicit activity. So I'll read it one more time. Whistleblower, a person who informs on a person or an organization engaged in an illicit activity. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So that's the Google definition definition of whistleblower. So it's basically uh, the opposite of um, um, the opposite of snitches get stitches. It's basically standing up for person, people, place, situation, and standing up and telling the truth um no matter who it's gonna i mean no matter what i'm telling the truth because it's the truth so you plug it in how it resonates um however that resonates but um i heard someone that um it sounds like somebody was trying to cover something up or they did it sounds like they did that they, they did and they got away with it for many years okay i heard they did and they got away with it for many years so, so yeah, so somebody, they did cover it up. They did cover it up, and apparently they were successful for many years, but it sounds like negative karma is about to come and get them. Whoever this person or people is, I feel it's probably several people. Um, but you only, you know your story, not anybody else. You plug it in, how it resonates. I heard a whistleblower that, I mean, someone who basically um, abused and um, abused and stole from a whistleblower in the past. So they not only stole from the whistleblower, but they abused them too in some shape, form, or fashion, you know, that could be you or somebody you're connected to, is about to receive negative heavy karma. And on the and another person, and that could be you or somebody you're connected to, is about to become a whistleblower soon. So um, whatever you're about to whistleblow on, um, however that plugs in your life and how, however that resonates, um, kudos to you. I just want to say kudos to you um, because um, we need more people like that in the universe. We really do. We need more people like that in the universe to stand up for situations. Um, wrong, wrong, wrong situations. Um, I was wrongfully terminated three times in a year, for goodness sakes. Um, and I mean, I called and reported to those companies that I was. Um, did I get my job back for any of those? No, but I know what I did what was right. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, and you know, there's been other situations in the universe too. Um, that's why I say to myself, that's why I say to myself, and I'm very selective with who I engage and interact with because um, so many people, they like to project upon you. They like to project upon you because they know what they did in the past and they like to shut you up and quiet you up um, because they know what they've done either to you or other people. So they don't want to feel as bad when um, about what they did to you or other people, but yet they want to keep doing what they're doing. 
Um, you plug it in how it resonates. And I don't judge anybody, but however, you should not harm anybody. Spiritually, physically, financially, mentally, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, period. I mean, period. And that's just the truth. Um, that's the truth. So you plug it in how it resonates, okay? Um, so a lot of whistleblower energy in here, a lot. Um, there's a whistleblower in the past. Um, it sounds like was abused and... Um, abused and stole from for years and that's about to come to the light and then at least one of you guys in the universe is about to become a whistleblower so something has happened in your life or is about to happen in your life to cause you to become a whistleblower um now whether you, i don't whoever gonna whistleblow to um that could be in a workplace um it could be in um a um it could be in a family dynamic maybe child protective services it could be uh, to police. I mean, I'm not sure. Whatever the situation calls here for you. Some kind of whistleblower energy. You plug it in, how it resonates. I feel bad to get to row, actually. I hope everybody is doing well. I do, I do, I do, do, just saying. Um, by the way, while I'm shuffling, I just want to let y'all know, I have not opened up personal readings yet. Um, I just haven't. Um, I just haven't. So I'm um, spending time on my own this weekend. So um, I might do it tonight, but if I do it, I'll do an official video. Um, like I have in the past, so just to let y'all know. Experiments of this you have for the collective. The Emperor Reverse, Five of Pentacles Reverse, Seven of Pentacles Upright. Someone who is so, so, so controlling in the past, so controlling. They're about to be forced to give up money they don't want to give up through many series of chain of events. Okay, so you plug it in, how it resonates. Wow. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So someone who was so, so, so controlling in the past. Um, I'm feeling it's the person or people that stole from the whistleblower because um, we're pulling in the person of uh, the whistleblower that was basically abused and stole from in the past and um, stealing from somebody's financial abuse. I heard stole from in um, abuse. So I think they were financially abused and other ways abused. Um, how that resonates. Um, and then we have the whistleblower upcoming energy. But someone that was um stole from you in the past basically about or about is about to be forced to give up money they don't want to give to give up basically so i think you whistleblower that was abused in the past and stole from in the past so financial abuse i think it's someone that did that to you because we're pulling in whistleblower energy in here um this is the person it could be a masculine or feminine they're coming up as emperor reverse now emperor reverse is control issues and in this case they want they stole your money. They're a thief. Um, control issues over money. So they're about to be forced to give up the money whether they, they don't they don't want to or not. It could be an Aries or anybody. It doesn't have to be an Aries. This is Aries energy, but it could be anybody is what I'm trying to say. Um, Emperor, Empress um, could be anybody. Um, in this case, they are Emperor in Reverse, and nobody wants to be Emperor in Reverse, but it can be a masculine energy or a fin that takes on heavy masculine in the Emperor Reverse in any sign doesn't have to be an Aries, but um, they 
I think they stole from you in the past, whistleblower, um, and abused you in other shape, some other shape, form, or fashion. They left you out in the cold. Oh, sorry. That was five of pentacles up right. They left you out in the cold financially. They left you out in the cold financially. So they put you out in the poorhouse because they stole from you. And then now they got to get the money back. Seven of Pentacles upright. Um, I heard they're going to be pissed. They're going to be pissed. Um, they shouldn't have stole the money from you to begin with. And I'm serious. They should, should not have stole the money from you to begin with. So um, you plug it in how it resonates. That's really terrible. And, you know, I don't understand why they did it to begin with. Um, I, they should have known eventually it was going to catch up with them. And I'm serious about that. Your messages you have for the second. The hang woman upright, four wands reversed. Oh, there's three. Okay, I'm sorry. The hang woman upright, the hermit upright, four wands reversed. Someone's getting a huge, huge, huge wake up call about wrongs that were done to a feminine energy. Huge wrongs. For some, hidden cameras in their house in the past. For some, extreme gang stalking. For some, theft. For some, all those things. It has completely changed their life around. Because of others, others' greed and selfishness. However, the tables are about to turn soon. Others are about to help the table turn. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. So this reminds me of Secret 7. I didn't hear Secret 7 in here, but it does. It does. So you plug it in how it resonates. So if this resonates for you, um, uh, I think it's you about to get enlightened about, um, I heard a hidden camera energy, theft energy, and um, gang stalking. So it could have been you that, had hidden cameras placed in your home or personal dwelling or vehicle or what have you. It could be listening devices too. Heard hidden cameras, but it could be listening devices as well. Um, they they pull the whole shebang on you. This resonates. Hidden cameras, possible listening devices, gang stalking, and um, and um, uh, theft, um, financial theft. And probably other abuse, because I think you resonate in category one in here, and I'm serious. Um, but I've heard others are getting enlightened to this. I heard it's turned your complete living situation upside down. So meaning you don't have the money like you should have had in the past because they stole it from you, whistleblower. Um, so it's probably left you in financial straits. Um, and for some, if you have children, it might have been, it might have um, caused um, problems in your home life with your children. Or for some, you could have, um, maybe you're in custody battles right now. And for some, you might have even lost custody of your children, possibly, because of all that mess. Uh, probably because spending all your money in the legal system, um, stuck in the legal system to try to win your kids back or to fight for your kids. And on top of that, you got stole from. So, I mean, that I mean that getting tied up in the legal system is not a joke. It's not a joke. I've had to go through many, many, many court situations in my life. Many. It's not a joke. And um, it will drain you financially. It will. And I've been a single mother going through the court system by myself with no financial assistance. Um, and I'm serious. I know it's different in other states. Uh, other states, especially if you're a single person, like they assist and things like that. But in my state, I've not seen any assistance for single parents um, in the court of law. At least I have not been informed of that. So, I mean, you plug it in how it resonates. But, I mean, I, 
I can only speak on my situation, but I mean, I'm just saying, I mean, not my situation, but my experiences, but, um, but I'm just saying, so you plug it in how it resonates, but it's left you in straits. I mean, they just did the most of you. Gang stalking, hitting cameras, financial theft, all of it. But somebody is getting enlightened about this. That's the hang woman energy. They're getting enlightened about this. I heard you're about to get lots of help from other people soon. They're, I think they're going inside, self-reflecting and um, thinking about this because this is uh, Virgo energy. Uh, for some, it could be a Virgo that's about to help you or somebody else. But um, Or somebody that has Virgo in the chart. But they're definitely, if they're not Virgo, they're going in Virgo energy. They're thinking about it, introspecting, thinking about the situation, basically. Four of Wands reversed. It's caused, I heard it's caused your home life to just basically turn upside down. And I'm sure when there's hidden cameras and people gang stalking you at the same time and they've stole from you, all of that combined together, how does your home life not get turned upside down? That's a huge unfair advantage if I've ever heard it. And it's all because whoever you are, you were a whistleblower in category one in the past. They were afraid of the information getting out, basically. And I'm true. Uh, that's, just, that's the truth. So they don't like that you speak the truth. But whoever you are, I think you've always been a truth speaker. And I think that's why they did it to you, because they were afraid um, that the truth would get out. and They knew how you were. And that's why they did it to you. Someone is getting a huge, huge, huge wake-up call. I heard someone is getting a huge, huge, huge wake-up call. I'm serious. I'm serious about that. I'm serious. Um, I'm serious. But it sounds like it's about to shift in your favor, whistleblower of the past, um, because I heard many people are about to help you. I think somebody over here is about to help you and whistleblow on this situation, um, because maybe they were one of the feeders of the camera of the past, or they helped gang stalk you in the past, and now they're regretful, or they know somebody that stole from you in the past, and they're about to report on that information. You plug it in how it resonates. Um, I'm serious about that. I think that's how this is connected. But you plug it in how it resonates. Let's pull a Kipper card and then I'm going to close it. I'm not going to make this real long. Um, I want to spend as much time on my own as possible today before they go back. Someone is trying very, really, really, really sneaky ways to try to get you put in jail. Some back in jail. However, it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Oh my God, this is so terrible. Someone is trying very, very sneaky ways to put you in jail is what I just heard. For some, back in jail. Um, but it's, I heard it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Um, whistleblower energy. Whistleblower energy. Okay, so you the whistleblower. So I think category one, because category two is upcoming whistleblower energy. So whoever you are in category two, if this resonates for you, because only you know your story, not anybody else, you have to plug yourself in where you fit. If you do, you haven't whistleblowed yet, I'm feeling, because uh, I heard you're about to. So um, I feel it goes, it goes in category one over here. Um, for some of you guys, you've never been in jail, it doesn't sound like before. Some you already have been. Um, some they're trying to put you in jail. Some they're trying to put you back in jail. But it's to shut you up. It's to shut you up. But I heard it's basically about the backfire on them. You plug it in how it resonates. This is terrible, man. For some, a doppelganger is very heavily involved in this. Very heavily. Okay, I heard for some, a doppelganger is very heavily involved in this, very heavily. So uh, for some of you guys, a doppelganger is involved, I think, in wanting to put you in jail or to put you back in jail. How that resonates. Um, doppelganger energy strong in here. For anybody who doesn't know, a doppelganger is someone that looks a lot very similar like you externally, but, but no, nothing like you on the inside, but externally, they look a lot like you. So um, whoever you are, um, whistleblower of the past. Um, apparently you have a doppelganger and that's this person right here. It could be a feminine energy or masculine takes on heavy femme. You plug it in how it resonates. Number two could be a very significant number in one's life. Number two, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible day of birth number, possible green card number, possible social security card number, possible jersey number. Number two, main people in reverse. I think this is your doppelganger energy. Um, she's coming in reverse because um, she's spiteful and malicious and she's trying to get you put in jail. For some, I feel first time jail. For some, 
back in jail. So you've already been in jail for something. And she probably had some hand in that too, possibly. For some. I didn't hear she did, but she might have. Only you know your story, not anybody else. Um, but she's trying really hard for some of you guys to put you in jail, to shut you up, basically. And two, to put you back in jail. Um, she wants to call you, she wants to cause you delays, blockages, grief, and sorrow in your life. Is what she wants to do. Um, that's basically the what I'm gathering here. Let me plug in my computer real quick. Okay, so let's pull one and then we'll close it. Spirit messages you have for the collective. Expectation reversed, high honor reversed, number 28 or 25 could be very significant numbers in one's life, number 28 or 25. It can be possible ages of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, possible social security card number, possible jersey number, 28, 25. Someone is about to be forced to come off a case soon. They are about to be shot. Extreme conflict of interest and horrible wrongdoings to a person of this case in the past. Oh my gosh, so you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. Heard someone's about to be forced to come off a case soon. Um, whoever this person that's on the case. Now, I on the case, I'm thinking that could be a legal case. And they work in the legal sector in some shape, form, or fashion, or it could be an investigative type of case. Um, however, that resonates in one's life. We've got whistleblower energy very strong in here. So um, I feel it like could go either way, um, however, that resonates, but it's some kind of case. Either it's an investigative case um, in some shape, form, or fashion, or it is a legal case, however, that resonates. But however, that resonates, I heard they're about to be forced to come off the case. They were, they were on this case um, in some shape, form, or fashion, but I heard they basically used, abused, and exploited somebody on this case, and there's extreme conflict of interest here. I think one of you guys has been enlightened to this situation or is about to be enlightened of it, and I think you're over here, and you're about to whistleblow on it, which is going to create a series of chain events to force this person to come off the case is what I'm thinking according to the spiritual downloads and what we've got in the reading so far. So you plug it in how it resonates, um, but they're on this case in some shape, form, or fashion, but there's extreme conflict of interest because they basically either stole from this whistleblower or um, abused this whistleblower in some other shape, form, or fashion um, and or something, but they don't have good intentions here um, and it's created huge conflict of interest basically. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. Um, and other negative series of chain of events are going to occur. And other negative series of chain of events are going to occur, I heard. So whoever they are, um, I feel they could work in like child protective services. They could work in the legal sector. They could work in investigative, like police investigative energy or um, some other kind of investigative energy. Um, in some shape, form, or fashion, it could be investigation, um, like um, some other kind of investigation. There's many investigations, um, you know, like EEOC energy or FTC. I mean, they could be an agent. They could be a marshal. They could be um, an officer, a police officer. I mean, whoever they are, but they are invest they're on some kind of investigative case in some shape, form, or fashion. There's some kind of professional in some shape, form, or fashion. But I heard they're about to be forced to come off the case. Um, but in all fairness, they shouldn't have abused this person. I think you person over here or the people in this situation, um, I heard they're gonna be pissed. So they're gonna get high on or reversed um, because they're about to be forced to come off the case. And I heard other negative series of chain events are about to occur. So you plug it in how it resonates. So no expectation from this person anymore. Um, whoever, is about to have this person come off the case, I think you resonate 
if you um, plug into the situation and this resonates for you, um, I think you resonate in this situation and getting enlightened in this situation. Um, and you're about to take some action. Um, you do not expect anything from this person anymore because you're about to get enlightened of it. All this crap. And so you're about to take them off the case. You have no expectations of them in this situation anymore. Um, and they're about to get high on or reversed. Um, and for some, it could have something to do with the family room because um, we had um, hidden camera energy in here, gang stalking, and physical theft. So you plug it in however that resonates, if that resonates, um, which I think made them the privileged lady um, because they stole from you. Or privilege man in them energy, how that resonates. Wow, man. Let me see if I hear anything else. By the way, these are psychic intuitive messages. Just let everybody know. Um, these are psychic intuitive messages from spiritual realm. Just uh, for newbies just joining. I've had a lot of newbies recently. Um, so just let everybody know. Things are about to completely turn upside down for many people in many ways soon. Some in positive ways, some in negative ways. All based on the choices you are about to make. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Her things are about to completely turn around for many of you guys in many situations in many different ways, all based on the choices you are about to make. So only you know your story, not anybody else. You plug it in however it resonates, whatever choices you're about to make. Uh, for some, it sounds like they're going to be positive choices. For some, they're going to be negative choices. Um, however, that resonates in one slide. For some, I feel, um, for some, it is for choices they have already made. For some, it's for choices they've already made. Okay, so for some of you guys, it's for um, your life is about to turn basically 360, either in a positive way or a negative way based on choices you're about to make. For some, your life is about to turn 360, either in a positive way or negative way because of the choices you've already made. Um, you have to plug it in how it resonates, however you fit into that situation. Uh, you have to plug yourself in wherever you fit if you do. We have emergence on the bottom of the deck. Someone is about to betray someone, not really a betrayal though, revealing of information on thieves and criminals of the past. These people never thought these people would reveal it on them and they're about to. To help, help balance the scales in the universe. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So if this resonates for you, I heard you're about to reveal information on thieves of the past. We have heavy thief energy in here and abuser energy. Um, uh, you never thought you would reveal the information. Um, oh, no, I'm sorry, not you. They thought the thieves and the abusers never thought you would reveal the information, whoever you are. Um, but I heard you're about to, and it, um, it's about to basically turn their, their life 360 upside down in a, topsy turvy way for them because it's going to create negative series of chain events is what it sounds like for them. Um, but you're about to be a game changer, a game player, a power player in this situation. So emergence of information, if this resonates for you, um, kudos to you. I feel you, you resonate in this category, whistleblower energy. Um, now that's exactly what I think. You're about to be a whistleblower. For some, you could be a whistleblower on this doppelganger because we're pulling this doppelganger in very, very, very strong wherever this doppelganger is. Um, very strong, if that resonates for you. 
There is some doppelganger out there for you in category one of used whistleblower of the past and stole from whistleblower um, that basically wants your life, I feel. They want your life. They want your money. They want every. They want to be you is what I'm feeling. And for some, I feel they have been you for many years. Um, that's exactly what I'm feeling here. But it sounds like somebody knows this situation and this information and they're about to emerge it on this doppelganger. That's exactly what I'm feeling. So you plug it in however it resonates. If that resonates for you, let me see if I hear anything else. Okay. I didn't. All right, you guys. Well, I hope this helped. I love you guys so very much. And namaste.